What's going on everyone? Welcome to the video. Um, so we are headed to the gym right now and we just got a brand new camera which we are filming with right now. A lot of people were saying the audio wasn't great so we're kind of hoping that this solves the problem and also has some better video quality as well. Um, so leave a comment if you notice the different video quality. Um, anyway, we are headed to the gym. If you saw uh, my last video, I did a little Ogus 753 review and mentioned how I'm not going to be doing it anymore. This is technically is the final week I'm supposed to be on Ogus 753, but rather than follow the programming, I think I'm going to test out my maxes. I was a little hesitant on doing that. I was th thinking about just kind of winging it and doing whatever I wanted, but someone left a comment that he's excited to see my max effort, so that kind of motivated me a little bit to try to max out and see what I can do. So I think today on squats, damn camera. So I think today on squats, I am going to try to max out. I think last time I did 410, so today maybe 415. We'll see. I'm gonna work my way up, and we'll see what happens. Um, I haven't lifted heavy in so long, so typically what happens when you do that, the weight feels awkward and heavy, and I don't know how it's gonna go, but we'll see. Anyway, we'll be there in a few minutes, and we'll see you then. Alright, so I'm about to start my warm well, I've been warming up, but I'm going to go over 315. Plan is 315 for 3, 365, and then we'll see how that feels if I want to jump up to like a new max of around 415, or if I want to try something in between that. Pull over, 135 for, you're pointing at the floor. 135 for 3, hopefully. Gonna and max maybe, out? Well, maybe I'll try to 155, but I don't think, I don't know if I'll We'll see. That was very easy. That was very easy. Nice vein. Definitely. Okay. What's the plan? Okay, 155 maybe? 315 felt a little awkward. Not that it was heavy, but a little awkward. 365 now, I think I'm just gonna go for one. We're gonna see how that feels and then take it from there. Alright, that felt good. We'll keep we'll keep going. We'll keep going. That look, that look good. Huh? That look good. Good. What do you think? It didn't feel bad. What so are you thinking? It felt kind of easy. I don't know, 165? A new max? Yeah. It's always so hard at this point to like get the in-betweens because you don't want to jump up too much because the weight feels too heavy, but if you don't jump up, if you jump up, what am I saying? I don't know. You jump up too fast, the weight feels too heavy, but if you do too small increments, you burn yourself out. So that balance is very hard to, to find. Honestly, typically I'm calling up from 365 right to the max, but just because I haven't lifted like above 320 on this routine for so long that the weight's feeling awkward. So I'm gonna hit one rep at 385, and then from there I'm gonna decide what to jump up to. So. that feel? Very difficult. I don't think I'm, I don't think I should go for a max. I don't think I'm going to hit it. I thought you had it too, actually. All right, so 385 really didn't feel so great. Um, I kind of anticipated it because, I, like I said previously on August 753, I'm not lifting heavy enough often enough. So 
I didn't want to, I didn't have a new max in me. I didn't want to even try the 405 and fail. So 385 is the highest I'm going to go. Backing it down to 365, hoping to go for two sets of three here, and then probably back it down again to like 315 and then two sets of five. So sorry to disappoint you guys that I'm not hitting the max. But it kind of just goes to my point in my last video that I don't think 8753 is the good routine for the plank. Yeah, judging by based how hard that 365 was, it's a good idea I didn't go any higher than that. I don't think I'm even going to do another set of that. I think I'm going to back it down to 315 because as you can see, my strength isn't what it was at the peak of 531. So that was disappointing. I thought I had it. I thought she had it too. I don't know. I, I don't know. She's doing some back downs of 135 now. So we're both done squatting. I'm gonna move on to some Romanian deadlifts, leg presses, some accessories. Paul's gonna do some other stuff I'm also. Okay. Yeah. I'm but we're gonna stuff. end the workout footage here. Um, basically, just kind of showed my point that I didn't think I got stronger on over 753. And I, it wasn't like a self fulfilling prophecy. I think it really is the fact that I was only 85% for so long. I didn't give my body the chance to accumulate a heavier weight. That's why I felt so awkward today. So. I don't regret my decision to stop using it, um, but we'll see you later on today because we're still excited about Chick-fil-A. I'm very out of breath. I'm very out of breath. I just, I just did a set of deadlift, Romanian deadlifts, but uh, we'll see you at Chick-fil-A. All right, so this is what I'm currently looking like in the morning. Just figured I'd see what I look like in the camera. So this is kind of more of a test, not really a physique update, but if you want to call it a physique update, you can call it that. But more for myself just to see this camera compared to what it looked like before and we'll get a thumbnail too all right so we are pulling into the parking lot at chick-fil-a now we're going to bring the new camera in there don't forget to let us know if you notice a difference in quality you better because we paid for this camera and it wasn't <laughs> that cheap so let us know what you think and we are going to walk over now we'll see you inside so we use the Chick-fil-A app now and it's so smart because you have to say when you're here, focus, I'm here. focus. If you say that you're here, you wait, do it. Wait, let's move out of the because we're right in the middle. Yeah, there's no cars coming. Did you do it? Oh, wait. Oh. They're preparing okay. it. Okay, never mind. Never mind. Last week we did it from this part and it told us that we weren't close enough because it has GPS, but this time it knows. It knows. It knows. Daniel, come on. I got this open. Okay. Chick-fil-A line is dying down. It's no longer outside. It basically starts back there and goes to the front. went back to the pickup line and she brings back like her fries and they're like empty and she's like you guys didn't give me fries and like I'm pretty sure she like ate them and then she went up and said that nobody gave it to her and I'm pretty sure she got her drink and I just like that she didn't have her drink. Oh I got so many sauces bro. Oh how many? I don't know she gave me a handful. This is awesome that Chick-fil-A does this, these Purell things. So we switched it up today a bit. We got a spicy chicken, not a regular chicken sandwich. And I was feeling very unhealthy for getting two fried chicken sandwiches last week. So I went with one grilled sandwich. I'm already starting. Um, Once you go fry, you can never go back. So I got the fried chicken sandwich again. And we got plenty of sauces for the week. Perfect. 
I'm gonna go with the grilled chicken first just because it's not as good. It's still so juicy and delicious. Tastes so healthy. I don't handle spice well. I'm sure to most of you guys this isn't that spicy. But for me, I gotta save the water or else I won't be in such good shape. Multivitamin. Spicy chicken sandwich. Do you wanna try a bite of spicy? Yeah. We're gonna trade. Ooh, it's spicy. She's gonna have a bite of the spicy chicken. Wait, I'm gonna bite your finger off. Mm -hmm. And I'm gonna try the non-spicy one. Yeah, spicy. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it was a male lamp. Mm -hmm. Look at all those sauces. Natalie. Okay, so, uh done with Chick-fil-A. It's still so warm out. It's like November 19th and it's really warm so that's a very nice thing. Um, yeah, Chick-fil-A was great. We kind of, I know you're probably getting a little bored seeing us go to Chick-fil-A so I apologize about that. I don't think we're going to go next week just because Thursday is Thanksgiving and then Saturday we're uh, seeing a comedy show, Jim Gaffigan. We're not going to have time. So. With my parents so we'll have to do something quick. And even though Chick-fil-A is supposed to be quick, it's just not. So, uh, I don't know. We'll see what we do then. But actually, oh no. What? I, I said on Friday, since we're both off on Black Friday, we might get Chick-fil-A breakfast. Oh, yeah. So you can see us get Chick-fil-A Chick breakfast. Chick-fil-A breakfast. Yeah. yeah. Oh, so funny stuff. Like, as we were leaving. Oh, yeah. I know. I, this happened, <laughs> I, it happened 30 <laughs> seconds ago and I already <laughs> forgot. As we were leaving, a little kid comes behind us and Adam thought that I was just blocking his way. And he's like, excuse me. And I turned around and I'm like, he goes, are you a blogger? And we're just like, yeah, but we're not very good at it. And he's like, what's your YouTube channel? And what do you do? And we're just like, we're like a fitness YouTube channel. And he was probably like 11 years old. Does he yeah. even know what fitness is? Just got the 16 handles. Ugh. Cheesecake place. I don't understand how black and white cookie is a topping. I don't know how I got chocolate on my. Look at him. Hey, right, right here. Nice. I need some cheesecake bites. Like those? Like those. I got the same old boring stuff. You know, whipped cream, some crushed doors, white. Chocolate things, yogurt chips, that's what they're called. Cheesecake, salted caramel. <clears throat> We're waiting on Adam. You can see him through the mirror. I feel like they have the large cups and they know I'm coming in Saturday night, so they get rid of the large cups to make me squeeze it into this smaller cup. Oh, yeah. My God. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Still you know, still sitting at the table. An and then there's bleach over there. <laughs> we just get that over the table. <laughs> Ew, no, put that away. I'm making it vanilla. No, we're gonna eat this. And then I wanna ask you guys something. So we'll come back when we're done. And uh, yeah. We'll finish up the video. I have no idea what he's gonna ask. She doesn't. <laughs> All right, so the question I wanted to ask you guys was what exactly do you want to see on this channel? I was thinking that I want to start some kind of like series to put some structure and order to the videos. Um, but the thing is I'm not competing so I can't do like a road to competition. Um, I don't exactly have it. I'm not recovering from an injury so I can't do like a road to recovery. So I don't exactly have anything that I can really think of other than take you through the next routine, whatever I decide to do. Um, so if you guys have any ideas, anything you want to see before I come up with anything, let me know. 
um, but I do want to think of something in the future to kind of put the videos in order so you know what's gonna what to expect rather than have some random videos. I apologize that this video seemed kind of random. We were kind of testing out the camera and excited to use it, so it was a little all over the place. Um, but we will get the videos a little bit more structured going forward. Um, but anyway, this video will be ending right here. So if you did like the video, hit that thumbs up button. Let us know if you notice any difference in the quality because like I said, it is a new camera. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Hi. And we'll see you on the next video. <laughs> that, that wasn't planned. That wasn't funny? I said that wasn't planned. Oh. <laughs> it's kind of funny. <laughs>